Hey guys, welcome back to the world of Minecraft. This is the Great Fishniz, and we are back. There's been a bit of delay. You can watch the world load with me. Uh, there we go. Okay, there's been a bit of delay uh, because I had, you know, life and stuff and things. And, ah, music. Okay, so I'm going to change that. Mainly because I'm just not a big fan of the background music. Where'd it go? There we go. And off. Done. There we go. Alright. So, we have our little crappy mud hut. We have uh, some stuff. We got, got some cobblestone, some andesite, and diorite, or whatever it is. And we found out uh, earlier that we can turn it into stuff. Ooh, we got iron. Let's go ahead and finish that iron out. Iron, as, as you just heard the, the jingle jingle there, that's us getting experience points. We are now level 3. Uh, come on, one. There we go. Man, this takes forever. Okay. Uh, yeah, levels. So what you do with levels, eventually you can uh, enchant stuff. That's cool. Enchanting is good. And you can uh, you can die and lose them. Uh, <laughs> pretty much, uh, I'm sure there's other things. I just don't remember them off the top of my head. So let's figure out what we're going to do next. Uh, crap. Ah. Ah, we're going to fall out of the house. That's what we're going to do next. Go ahead and put the, uh, no, no, that's not what that's for. Uh, there's nothing really left we want to cook, per se. Okay, so we're good. Uh, let's go to the crafting table. We'll take our andesite. We'll make it into the polished andesite like we did previously. And we will stick that in the chest for our pretty things. Pretty things, pretty things, pretty things. Uh, let's keep the cobblestone on us. Iron. We have iron. We have wood. Let's make some better tools. So we broke our pickaxe before, but now we have an iron one. And we also encountered uh, some zombies. And uh, they basically we just walled them in. So we're gonna make a sword, and let's make uh, let's make a pair of pants. For our armored bear. And let's see here. A helmet. So we got pants and helmet. So so taking care of the most important things. There we go. There we go. Aren't we fancy? We are amazing. Okay. Burp. That thing is loud. Alright, dropping that off because we don't want to lose that. That would be very bad. And I think we should go kick some zombies' butts. What do you think? Let's go kick the crap out. Ow! That hurt. Okay. There we go. Let's not do that again. We fell for our own trap. You can tell it's been a little while since I played because I just completely fell for my own trap. And, uh... Ooh, we don't have any torches. Making torches. Because we want to keep this place pretty well lit. Ah, I think there's always were this way. And, uh, uh, ooh, more iron. Here we go. Here's our don't open dead inside. Alright, sucker. Where you at? I can hear you moaning. I think. Oh, crap. This is where the game becomes kind of a horror game at that point. When you walk into a room like that, especially if you don't have any coal and no torches. Ooh. Ooh, I like this. Big old underground room. Might be able to turn this into an evil laboratory. Get a little bit of coal to get back some of these torches we've been expending. Just a little bit there. All of the caves, all of the darkness, all of the time. And we need more coal. Or torches. Ah! So, just saying, really bad idea is standing in the middle of a dark room making torches. So, that was a very Bernstein Bears thing. thing. Bernstein Bear. Maybe that's what I'll name my guy. I'm Bernstein. Forget the great fishnizz. This is Bernstein. 
Holy crap, this place goes on forever. Water. I hear it over there, but I don't hear it over here. We'll come back to that later. That could end up in a lot of digging not going anywhere. Huh, dead end. Well, I guess we will go back to that right now. Hunting the sounds of water. And digging and digging. And unfortunately, sometimes in Minecraft, that's getting dark again. You do get to that. Where do the sounds of water go? Ghost water. Hmm. I wonder if that was the sound of zombies peeing. Seems like our zombies despawned. That can happen. It's somewhat disappointing, but it does happen. Okay, so we, we passed a lot of really good stuff in here, and I'm sure somebody out there is just freaking out because I have not been picking up all of the iron and the great resources that we have been passing. I am instead exploring aimlessly through this cavern and wasting all my torches. Ah, come back here. And using up all the coal I have with me. So we'll have to pick up some more. Oh, yeah, convenient. Okay, so big tip for Minecraft, you generally don't want to dig up, just like I'm doing, or straight down. So the reasons for that is, much like we heard water, there are things that flow. You know, I, I mentioned earlier that there's gravel that'll fall, stuff like that. If you're digging right above you, those things that do fall could potentially fall right on your head. And uh, the one you're really worried about is lava. I mean, just saying, it's lava. Okay, got some of that. And... Walkie walkie. And people are texting me. You probably all heard that. Also, if you're digging down, sometimes you'll come like that. Straight down. Break your legs. Ooh. Let's see if we can build a impromptu stairwell here. That didn't work. There we go. Use that to mark our little stairwell. There's more iron. We really should have been collecting iron because we're using up iron with our little pick here. All of the things. All of the things. We are iron rich right now, which is not a bad thing. Whoops. There we go. Iron rich is not a bad thing to be. Uh, there will come a point in time where we will desperately need iron. Honestly, we, we kind of already do. Ooh, you see that light? <gasps> lava! Lava! Okay, do not run straight at lava. Life pro tip. Okay, so around lava you get good stuff. You're now at the... Spitting at me, no? Okay, so you're at the level where you get neat stuff. One of the things I'm really excited to show you guys is redstone. Redstone is how you'd make circuits and all that jazz. There we go. Block you off. There we go. Now we got a little path here. Uh, anyways, you can use redstone. It acts kind of like an electrical current. And with that electrical current, you get to do lots of neat things. You can make clocks. You can make doors that are automatically opening. You can make complex systems to harvest food with. And, you know, stuff. Stop. Curse you, you fluid dynamics. Alright, so here we go. We are past the lava and in a hole. Ooh, iron. Stuff. 
Okay, so... Dirt. That's what that noise was. Uh, now I'm lost. There we go. Let's see. We should... Oh, diamonds. Diamonds are the miner's best friend. So, diamonds, you can do all sorts of awesome stuff. It is the best material in the game when it really comes down to it. Uh, anything that you make with iron, pretty much, you can make out of diamonds. You can make armor, you can make tools, uh, you can make all sorts of awesome stuff. Uh, you can make a record player with diamonds, which is cool because in the deep, sometimes you'll run across a dungeon. And in those dungeons, you may find a record which has pretty cool spooky music. Uh, that is the only instance I'm really big into having music in Minecraft. I know that there's probably some of you out there screaming heretic, but face it, I started playing Minecraft with a really crappy computer originally and could not handle it. Looks like we've come full circle. And people are calling me. It is time for me to pause and answer because it's important. Ha ha! Okay, I'm back from that uh, minor disturbance. Uh, that was a very vital phone call. A friend of mine from Baltimore asking for assistance on uh, on building his Dungeons and Dragons character. Uh, basically, he had a really low roll and uh, he didn't know what to do with it. So, uh, did, I, did I do that? Crap, I'm out of torches again. I keep getting out of torches. Eh. Alright, here we go. Okay, back at it. We were doing stuff, I think. Not really sure. I think we were just exploring. Pretty much went zombie hunting, couldn't find any zombies. Pretty crappy zombie hunter. And uh, we went exploring. And found some lava. That's that's a thing. There we go. There's our way out. Wasn't really what I was hoping for. But that's okay. Pretty good. Pretty decent. Um how do I get back out of here? Yeah, so one thing that happens in Minecraft a lot is you get lost in your own caves. So we're going to go up. There's more up. More up, better. That's why you don't dig down, kids. Right there. We just saw it. Boop. See if we can... Yeah, there we go. Like a boss. We should probably fill that hole in. There we go, because otherwise we would fall to that much like we fell to our own trap. Um, and I'm lost again. Big room. Hey, there's the big room. This is the room I want to turn into a base. There we go. Maybe it's this hallway. Oh, sweet dear lord, I'm lost. Okay, so all else fails. Nerd pole. So what you want to do in the what you want to do in the case of a nerd pole, that's gravel. When you're lost like this, dig up as far as you can. Get some crap that you don't need. Dirt works good. Jump in place. And it's gonna get dark. And then dig up again. Yeah, that wasn't enough. Ah, oh, crap, I can't see. I'm in a hole! Alright. Jump place, jump place, jump place, jump place, jump place. Okay, I'm stuck again. That noise was lava. That is a very bad thing for us to be hearing right now. Aha! Something. Hmm. Makes me wonder how deep we are. I can make this a little wider so we can get the torches going. Because that whole gaming in darkness is uh, not so much fun. Also, you'll notice that I'm getting very hungry. That also is bad because if we run out of food, we start to starve to death. Much like in real life, boys and girls. 
daylight. Holy sh... Okay. Yeah, with that one, I will end for right now. Um, great fishing is... Uh, I'm out.